In today's vlog, I wanted to talk about another problem that I see people having when they go to learn mathematics, and that is that there isn't an immediate payoff. When we learn something like martial arts, it can very much feel like every single step we're taking is progress. When we learn how to throw a punch or a kick or do a dive roll or do a throw, we can practice it. And though it might be tedious and involve some exercise on the side, we at least understand that we're making progress and getting better at that skill. With mathematics, it feels like you learn the quadratic formula, but then no problems jump out of the sidewalk and say, solve me or die. What do you do when you don't feel like there's an immediate payoff to what you are doing? Well, I have three answers to that. One is a bit indirect. While you are learning mathematics, you are learning the art of thinking, rationalizing, being logical, tearing apart assumptions, drawing conclusions, checking yourself to see if you are correct. These are very important skills to be able to have. And while I freely admit that there are other disciplines in which you can learn that, math is a very good one. It is very effective at what it does. Second, again indirect, is that you are preparing yourself for the jobs of tomorrow. Even if you're not going into the hard sciences, computer sciences, business world, you can still find yourself needing to understand some mathematics, at least enough to deal with the situations you're being asked to deal with in your job, in your profession, in your entrepreneurship, whatever. What I'm saying is as the world becomes more technically saturated, our need to be analytical only goes up. But third, and much more directly than the first two, there's just a lot of beauty here. Hear me out. When I learn about mathematics, there actually is a sense of learning something beautiful. There is nothing quite like seeing a proof that is incredibly elegant, precise, minimalistic, and yet world-shatteringly effective. There are things out there that have changed the world, changed the way we view cryptography, or changed the way we could understand physics. These things are beautiful. It can be buried by the day-to-day -day grind of grades and homework, or someone saying, you have to do this, when it seems to ring hollow in your heart. But if you allow yourself to shuffle off those problems and allow yourself to look directly at them without ego and without saying, I have to be right, rather, I have to learn, you will find that you can see that same beauty as I do, because there really is something very amazing there. They say that math is the language of the universe, and to some extent that's true. Perhaps it's a language that we invented to help ourselves understand what the universe was saying, but more to the point, there is a very human beauty to mathematics. And so my suggestion to you, if you are looking for an immediate payoff to learning this stuff, don't just think about how it's going to benefit you in the long run in terms of, I am going to be more analytical or I'm gonna be prepared for the jobs of tomorrow, but more to the point, find something beautiful that speaks to you in it. It may be that you need to dig deep into mathematics to find something beautiful that speaks to you, but it is there. Now, as I'm sure you understand, this is not a solution to every single problem in mathematics. I've still got a lot of topics left to cover, but hopefully it helps. Well, it's been a while since my last vlog. Sorry about that. I've got more coming up. Understand that I am still in the learning process here. I really am not quite an amateur anymore, but I am not yet what I would consider to be a fast professional with this stuff. So as things go forward, as I improve my skill, there's going to be kind of a give and take of, I'm gonna try something new and advanced, but then I have to learn how to do it, and that might take a little bit more time. So this is just part of the process, and everything that I'm telling you about mathematics and the beauties you can find in it, I'm living through right now learning a skill that I was never formally trained in, and that is video editing and YouTubing. So anyways, thank you so much for listening, and I hope you have a fantastic day. Adieu. Thanks for watching. If you like this video, please click like and subscribe. If you really like the video, come on over to our Patreon page where you can get involved and see all the cool stuff we're doing.